I love having a Southern mother. I'm such a half-breed, though. Like, I have a Southern mother. She's so conservative. She quit her choir when they added a tambourine. She's very conservative. <laughs> so she's a Presbyterian. And, ah, uh, <laughs> she's very conservative and more Christian than me and all of you. She's very Christian. And um, her choir, they sing so high that only small animals can hear them. <laughs> yeah. And my mother always goes for the solo, right? She's not even in the choir. She's not even in the choir. You can hear her going, how great thou art. And you can hear the voice of God being like, not so great, Barbara, not so great. Why don't you go to rehearsal instead of watching Dancing with the Stars, okay? I don't mean to bag on the Dancing with the Stars. I know that that is a huge thing. It is a huge thing. My mother is addicted to Dancing with the Stars. I didn't get it. I found out that last season they had 42 million people vote in the finale for Dancing with the Stars. 42 million. Let's think about that, ladies. That is more than any Senate election or governor election that I've ever heard of. So this is what I'm talking about. 2016, we take the top two presidential candidates and we make them dance it out. You know what I mean? I think whoever has the best samba wins. I do. I think it's, I think that's my political humor. I know. Am I the only woman in this whole place that will admit that they get mad at their significant other, just a little mad when he gets sick? Is that